the fuck? The ducks. Ducks in a pool of Palm Springs. No birds. Sun don't stop for nobody, man. Sun don't fucking stop. Sun gonna be up in the morning regardless. That sun is gonna be up in the morning regardless. Regardless of how I fucking feel and how depressed I am, the sun is gonna fucking shine in the morning. And at nighttime, the moon gonna be there. And you gonna look up, these days gonna keep going by. So do you let the days go by and look up and you done wasted a year doing what? Or do you just pick it up? All right, well, gotta figure it out. Made some mistakes, life goes on. Let me figure out life from this point. I like to introduce myself. My name is King. It's 3.30 in the morning, and I'm going to get ready for work. I'm uh, going back on route. I haven't been on route in like over three weeks now. When I injured my knee, you know, so um, being extra quiet because my wife is still knocked out. 3.30 in the morning. I missed the shit. So the hardest part about being awake this early in the morning is the fact that my wife still has COVID, or we think she does, I don't know. She needs to get tested. But also, I have to walk to the patio and it's freezing outside. I wanna say it's about 49 degrees outside. So, that, so my nipples are kinda hard. So my wife being my wife, she wants to control everything I do, right? I told you to put all your clothes that you're going to change into in the guest room so you change in there. And now you got to walk to the patio and be cold. I'm like, it's not even cold outside, to be honest with you. I'm out here still. No shirt. Just saying. All right, y'all. It's currently uh, 723 in the morning. I'm headed to Palm Springs. 141 stops today. 202 packages to deliver. And, um... Already having issues at the logistics center here. They, um, I mean, they mislabeled one of my carts, and so one of our dispatchers thought that my third cart was someone else's cart. Kind of find out it was mine. So, anyway, uh, we'll see what's up, man. Okay, so. I'm in Palm Springs. It's, I think it's a beautiful neighborhood because it's quiet. It's very, very open out here, right next to the mountains. Um, Looking for 59791. And the Flex app says it's on the right. Um, is there a house there? Y'all see a house? Am I tripping? There's no house there. And then uh, if I, down the left side, no house. I found the house, it's actually a little ways back there, but still, it's like this app with the navigation in it telling us where to go. And it, this is what um, a lot of the drivers complain about and nothing's being fixed. They tell us to fix it, but or help them fix it. But no matter how much we try to help them, they don't do anything about it. Other than that, I like the job. Man, they want me to put the packages behind the gat. Gangster. Never let anybody sign for the package when we're not home. Put small packages in the mailbox. So what you're telling me is you want me to commit crime. Federal crime. I'm not cool, man. No! No! <laughs> oh, man. 
So look at that's how close we are to the mountains or whatever these are. So I'm on lunch now. It is currently 11.34. I'm gonna go back to work at 11.42. I'm gonna head into Gateway when I get back. Gateway is a part of Palm Springs that some people, some drivers are afraid to go into. Um, if you're ever looking for black people in Palm Springs, go to Gateway. Apparently there is a Gateway Crips um, in, in that area, so. I just got a text message from dispatch saying, hurry, hit gateway. He said, knock that one out early so that before the gate. <laughs> he said, knock, knock that one out early before the Crips wake up. Now, I'm not afraid of Crips. I'm not afraid of, I don't know. I mean, personally, I just would rather not have to deal with anyone. Amazon offers you a hub to go to, to get your stuff delivered to, right? They offer lockers. You can go to certain Rite Aids to pick up your stuff. I remember for a while, I was going to Stein Martin La Quinta to pick up my stuff. And the reason why I bring that up is because, you know, if you know you're in a shady neighborhood, you know you're in a neighborhood where people just steal. Just have it sent to the nearest hub. Or, you know, like here in this cove, looks like the nearest business is this Valero that I'm at. So why not ask the Valero people to create a hub? Wouldn't it be more beneficial for Amazon to provide lockers and little hubs, you know, like whatever, um, safer places for people to receive their packages? That's just my two cents. All right, so it's 18.20, 6.20 for those of you who don't do military time. I got done with my route before 4 o'clock, like I want to say about 3.45-ish. I had 141 stops, 202 packages all together. And... I guess everybody was pretty much helping out in Palm Desert. And um, so for the most part, I think I took care of at least half of my route. Give or take. But um, and, and, and when dispatch sends me help, I don't ever say no. One time I got prideful about it about a month ago. And my wife was like, why? Just take the help. Get done sooner. So, whenever they send help, I'm like, okay. I mean, I feel like I can do my job, but come on over. But then that's when I hate when they're like, oh, you know, we had to send you. Duh, duh, duh. You didn't have to send me no one. You could have sent me no one. But the problem is, is even though we have 11 hours to deliver, dispatch and all the leadership they want to get done by five six hours anyway i'm home now i just had uh dinner i got el ranchito got myself a carnitas burrito got my wife some uh carne asada tacos with guacamole i also got myself two taquitos and i got myself a large mica i'm gonna change my clothes, get into more comfortable clothing, and just chill out and probably go to bed by 8.30. Yeah. Anyway, thank you for watching. Have a good night. Remember that you're loved, and remember to be great every day. It's your boy, King Chiro. Every day you wake up, you got a decision to make. To go right or left, up or down, right or wrong. At the end of the day, you make the decision. Nobody forces you. So make the right decision. Make moves. Set the goals. Stop making excuses, man. And if it look like a duck, walk like a duck, and sound like a duck, it's a duck. Stop guessing.
Just do the right thing. You heard? You hear me? I love y'all. Stay positive. Love one another. All right. <laughs> <laughs>